Good morning. It's January 3rd. I'm back. I'm headed out on a walk. It's a rainy day. I got a new piece of gear that I want to try and see if it will keep me drier. I got a poncho. It's from Amazon. The company is on you. And the reason I'm trying a poncho is because I got so drenched on my section hike last year. I got drenched. I had no cover for my backpack. Um, which is from and not enlightened equipment. My backpack is from Hyperlite Mountain Gear, so it's pretty waterproof, but it still would be nice if the outside of the pack stays dry. And so this guy is really big and will go on and even cover a backpack, which I think I would just like more. And I'm still not really a fan of carrying that umbrella. Like, it definitely helped. I just don't, it, you can't use both your trekking poles if you have to carry an umbrella in your hand and getting it to stay on the pack is doable, but it's wonky and wobbly. So I'm gonna give this a try and see how dry it keeps me. So of course now it's probably not raining, although it is supposed to rain all day. So let's check it out. Well, here I am out on my walk in my giant orange poncho, which covers all the way down to mid shin and it's not raining. <laughs> of course it's not raining. I feel like though if I wouldn't have put it on it would be raining but anyway it covers my day pack and I plan to be out here walking for like <laughs> two hours so hopefully it'll rain it's supposed to rain all day there's like this crazy this winter has been crazy, right? Like we had that deep Arctic freeze at Christmas. And now this week we're having a heat wave, which for January means like 50s and 60s. Tomorrow it's supposed to be over 60 degrees during the day. I don't know, with lots of rain. So, I still hope that I can get a good test run in of this poncho because my green rain jacket that I used on the trail last May, I need to treat it to make it water repellent again because it is not water repellent at all anymore. The fabric just completely soaks through and once I treat that I can just make that my daily, my normal daily rain jacket. All it's good for now is a wind layer. Three cheers for rain. It's finally raining and not that it hasn't rained since I had this poncho, uh, but it hasn't been 
really a steady rain whenever I've gone out to walk to get a good feel for how this poncho will work. I have theories that there is no way to stay 100% dry when you're walking or hiking in the rain because even if the rain gear is repelling the water, your body is a furnace in creating heat and condensation and making you wet from the inside. So there's that. I think the only way to know for sure the water repellency of anything is to be perfectly still <laughs> in the weather. So I think the biggest test and sense of whether this rain gear keeps water out will be on the dryness of my backpack. If the back of my day pack that's not touching me is completely dry, then I will call this a very waterproof or water repellent piece of gear. So I'll let you know when I get home. All right, I made it back to my building. I'm standing in the mail room. I'm pretty drenched. It, the rain has gotten heavy. Um, I walked for about two hours and I think about a half an hour into my walking, it started to rain. So let's get this gear off and see what we look like. So my feet are drenched, which is not surprising. And below the knees, my, my pants are soaked. which is also not surprising. Um, my head feels pretty dry. Um, yeah. My hat is extremely dry. I mean, oh God, hat head. Um, my hair is damp, but that could be from exertion. And the sleeves on my puffy coat are definitely uh, wet-ish where the poncho was sitting on me. But yeah, anywhere the poncho was touching my jacket, it's not drenched, it's just damp. And so far so good. I'm definitely drier than I was with a rain jacket. This is what I was hoping. My day pack is pretty bone dry. Which is great. That makes wearing a poncho worth it. And then stripping off my puffy coat. I'm much drier on the inside as well. As much drier than I was the other day when I had my raincoat on. I mean, my raincoat does need to be re-waterproofed. I think, but I'm pretty dry. I'm damp, but I think this kind of dampness comes from being hot under my puffy coat from walking. So yeah, I'm really happy with the way that poncho performed. And the only thing I need to add to stay a little bit drier would be my rain pants. So, oh, I forgot to mention, 
I got it in bright orange too because I live in Pennsylvania where the hunters hunt on the AT because it's in game lands. So yeah, that's the new poncho. Pretty happy with the performance of that thing overall. It also has grommets. I don't remember if I mentioned that. There's grommets on it, so you could use it as a tarp if you needed to. Or you could throw it over top of your tent for extra rain reinforcement. If you have wondered about whether to use a poncho or not, I would recommend it. I mean, I recommend all the rain gear. <laughs> all right, I'll see you guys next time.